Namaste. Today is Sunday morning and most mandirs are closed. How life is uncertain that we don't know what is coming next. Here and all over the world, coronavirus has put us in a state of contemplation. We never know what could happen next. It is a blessing in disguise because it gives us an opportunity to see how strong we have this, we have inner strength. Or do we need to look to socialize to have our life interesting? However, we pray that um, this coronavirus doesn't wreak havoc, but it's all in the hands of the Lord and let us think that we have to surrender to him and ask him to give us the wisdom so that we can accept whatever is happening and make a positive impact on our life. Oh. guide us and being the prophet of age Guru Maharaj his reformation is to bring people to properly execute right thoughts right words and right actions so that we can move closer to that place of consciousness we came from and our prayer should be oh Lord oh God whoever we worship, Krishna, Ram, Christ, whoever, that, oh Lord, I want to be like you. Help me to rediscover I am just like you, consciousness. Uh, to come to that state where there is no name and form, go beyond all the images of worship, the murtis. So let us pay adoration to the spiritual masters and we adoring them with this bhajan, a prayer that says, Oh God, you are the one that will give me this knowledge. You are the one who will give me that uh, wisdom to re rediscover um, consciousness. You are my worship, whatever deity we worship. You are the one to protect me and you are the one to give me that strength so that I can move forward. You are that master the one that will give me moksha. Guru Mat Pita Guru Vandu Saka Tere Charana Me Guru Mera Koti Prana Tere Charana Me Guru Mera Koti Prana Tomi Gyana Tata Tumi Shakti Rata, Tumi Shanti Rata, Tumi Mukti Rata, Tere Charna Me Guru, Mera Koti Prana, Tumi Sadhana, Tumi Aradhana, Tumi Premarana, Tumi Karana, Tumi Pranapati, Tumi Raksha Mera, Tere Charna Me Guru, Mera Koti Prana, 
तेरे चरणों में गुरु मेरा को की प्रेरणा तुम्हें भी दाता तुम्हें परम पिता तुम्हें राज धी राज गुरु महाराज तुम्हें राज धी राज गुरु महाराज गुरु मात पिता गुरु बल तेरे चरणों में गुरु मेरा कोटि प्रणाम। You know our scriptures are our guide, and um, we are advised that we should go to these scriptures in moments when we have doubts as to what is the the drama of of the Lord. And we see the drama playing out now very so clearly. In Guyana, elections are going on. Uncertainty is there. Uncertainty with this coronavirus. But the only way to cope with this is to really move into that place of consciousness. And the Lord said it, Krishna Bhagavan said it, that he was there in the beginning of his consciousness. And then out of his playtime, he created this universe. The whole, all the planets, all the stars, the whole universe. And he also created human beings and all the living matters. And he entered into these, his creation to animate it, to give them life. This is he so he's existing in us as that consciousness and he's supporting all that he created all, all that was created consciousness that creates everything and this consciousness we are that consciousness and he says that i am omnipotent all powerful i'm omnipresent meaning i'm all pervading I exist all over the universe I am omniscient, I'm all-knowing, I know the past, present, and the future. So with that being said, we have the potential to return to that place where we didn't have a name and a form, we are the most powerful, the most subtle consciousness, subtler than space. Imagine space is supporting all the other elements and the whole universe. We are even subtle and much more powerful than that in mean that we are consciousness. But the whole purpose of the human life is to move from that lower state of consciousness, manifestation, into the original state where there was no name and no form. So if we follow this and we ask for the guidance of spiritual masters and gurus, learned ones, then naturally we'll be moving towards that state of consciousness. So today, this is my humble message to you, that um, do your meditation, do your introspection, find out how you can help someone else. And with that being helping someone else, you will get the wisdom and you'll be able to live in these moments of trials and tribulations, to the lotus feet of all the deities and the gods and goddesses that we worship and the gurus and spiritual master. Namaste. Jai Gurudev.